everyone, Renee here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy to be with you for day seven of our 30 day challenge. Remember to comment below after you complete each video. At the end of this 30 days, there is a giveaway for an Amazon gift card, but you need to complete all 30 videos. And the more times you complete them, the more entries you will get into the giveaway. So don't forget, let me know how many times you do them and how often. Okay, so today's workout is going to be glute bridges. This is one of my favorite exercises to work your glutes. So we're gonna work it for five minutes straight. You do not need any equipment. There's always that option to set a light weight on your hips to add a little more tension, but maybe you try it through without that and see how it goes. And then if you do it a second time, you can try it with the weight to add a little more intensity, a little more spice to those muscles. So I'm gonna show you the form and then we'll get started. So you're gonna lay down on your back. Your arms will be long by your side, and you wanna bring your feet in that you can almost touch them with your fingertips. You're about hip width distance. You want them flat, and your upper body just rests on the mat or on the floor. And you're gonna squeeze your glutes to lift them up into a bridge. You wanna think a straight line from your knees all the way to your shoulders. So you don't wanna go up too high where you're at your arch neck or too low. You wanna find your nice sweet spot where you feel the activation there. And that's what I want you to work on. Your upper back is on the mat. And that is your perfect form. And then I will take you through some different exercises as we go. Let me set the timer. And we will get started. Okay. So everybody come down to your mat or the floor. Arms are long. And squeeze your glutes to so lift them up into your nice bridge position. Your abs are pulled in here. And so you just want to be with a little lower. And you're down and squeeze it. So here you're putting pressure in your heels as you squeeze your glutes right up to the top. And you want to think of squeezing inward. And with even though you're coming down, try not to let the activation of those muscles go. So you're just going up and down for just a few minutes as we activate them and then we're going to have a little fun. And you want to think of your core is still engaged here. So your entire lower body right around the floor is all working. So now we're going to double it up. So we're going to think up twice and then down twice. So we're going to squeeze, squeeze, double, and then lift, down, down. Yes. You should already start to feel this. The best way to make sure that you're really working your muscles is to put that mind to muscle connection. I know I use that a lot. But you can just be going through the motions and you will not feel it. The second you really think, okay, what am I activating? What am I working? You will get a better burn and it'll come quicker. And that's what I want you to picture. A few more. Like that. Yes. Smile through it. Work your lower body. Your lower body is your biggest muscle group in your entire body. And so it's always great to have a strong lower body. That helps to speed up your metabolism, which means you get to eat more. So it's great. Bonus. Okay, so now we're just going to hold it up top and you're going to pulse. And so now you're just at the top. Remember, press into your heels even more. Yes. You got it. Hold your squeezes, and you're going to send your right leg straight up toward the ceiling. And now you're just going to squeeze with your left side. So just like down and up, little movements here. Lower and lift. Your left leg is where this, your right leg is where it's tail, and your left leg is what's activating and is what is working. You should really feel the bottom of that glute. You'll also begin to feel your hamstring. Whenever we single leg out, it gets deep. Yes. I hope you're enjoying these five minute videos. I'm really enjoying doing them with you. I like this commitment. Okay, switch sides. So left leg up, so now right leg. I know I've talked to some of you and some of you are saying you'd love to do them in the afternoon. Right around that three, four o'clock when you're getting that you know, sluggish feeling in the afternoon, some of you are telling me that you'd love to wake up and do them first thing in the morning. There's so much, so many options of when you can just add in this little bit of workout. And remember, anything you can do is better than nothing. So just turn it on. Okay, left foot comes down. So now I want you to walk your feet out a little bit longer. So you're kind of at three quarters of a bed and you're gonna just lower and lift. So now you're gonna feel this more into your hamstring. And that's great. And you wanna think of press 
sink your feet into the floor. So you're thinking of almost the opposition movement. Feet press in, your glutes pull up. They're almost like separating from each other. That's kind of what you want to picture. Guess what, you only have a minute and a half left. You're so close. Hold this next one at the top. You're going to do two squeezes up and down. Two squeeze, squeeze, lower and go. Lift, lift, down, down. Yes. Nice and tight. Pressing your feet away. And your glutes pull up. Your upper body gets to relax, which means you are just focusing on your lower body. So now we're gonna, we only have about 45 more seconds, but we're gonna walk our feet in. You're gonna bring your right foot in, left foot in, right foot out, left foot out. Now left foot in, right foot in, left foot out, right foot out. So just keep going back and forth. You should bring your feet in. One more each side. Now hold both your feet out and just squeeze and squeeze. Yes, you only really have 20 more seconds. We're gonna speed it up here. Let's go up, 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 up. Yep, final 20 seconds. Nice and fast, nice and tight. Press away. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Slow and lower everything down. Bring your knees into your chest and just rock from side to side. You wanna release your lower leg. Take a deep breath and slowly roll up to a seated position. Thank you all for joining me for day seven. Remember to like and subscribe down below so that you can be notified when new videos are posted daily. Have a great rest of your day. I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye, everybody.